Queen's Gambit declined, semi Tarusk, main line, exchange variation, 6, NXC37.BXC3CXD48.CXD4BB4 plus 9.BD2BXD2 plus 10.QXD2011.BC4. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. Black got the better of white in that game. Both players had an amazing opening. That was an incredible middle game by both players. Black had the better end of a sloppy end game. Opening with the Queen's Pawn. The Indian game begins by controlling the important e4 square with the Knight, rather than a pawn. By taking control of the crucial d5 square and creating a space on which the Knight can move to c3 without obstructing the c-pawn, move c4 helps to create a strong center. The move e6 creates a line for the dark squared bishop, sets up a rapid castle, and prepares to push a pawn to d5 and recover the piece if it is taken. And c3 develops the knight to fight for the e4 square and to control d5. As it occupies space in the center, attacks the c4 pawn, and aids in maintaining control of the e4 square. By doing this, a knight moves out of its beginning square and into the action. C5 fights for central control, attacks the d4 pawn and prepares to develop the queenside knight behind the c pawn. Cxd5 captures black's central pawn. Recaptures. A pawn kicks the opposing knight, forcing it to move or risk being captured. It is a fair deal after all captures. This exchange is fair. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. Backs off. By growing a bishop from its initial square, this activates it. This blocks the check from an opposing bishop. This is the only good move. It is a fair deal after all captures. Recaptures. Castling gets the king to a safer square, out of the center of the board, while also developing a rook. Castling kingside tends to be safer because the king is further from the center. By growing a bishop from its initial square, this activates it. This develops a knight from its starting square, activating it. The rooks can see each other now, allowing them to provide mutual defense. As a result, the bishop grows and gains flexibility on the long diagonal. It is the final book action. So, the attacked pawn is protected. It is quite good. The rook is now on an open file, which helps control squares across the board. It is quite good. The best choice is this one. It is ideal. This loses a chance to imply that winning a pawn is possible. It is incorrect. This enables the adversary to make a passed pawn. It is incorrect. Backs off. It is ideal. By moving a rook from its starting square, this activates it. It is quite good. While not a mistake, that is also not the wisest course of action. That's good. When the queen retreats, this attack wins a tempo. That's good. This suggests exchanging items of equivalent value. That's good. This exchange is fair. That's good. Recaptures. It is ideal. This puts the opposing rook in a position to lose control of the open file. That's good. This keeps the material balance in check with good commerce. It is ideal. Backs off. It is ideal. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. It's alright. That's good. This provides an equal exchange of parts. That's good. The queen is now on a square that is more secure. That's good. This poses a risk of winning a pawn. That's good. This makes it impossible for the adversary to gain a pawn. That's good. This suggests exchanging items of equivalent value. It is quite good. It is a fair deal after all captures. It is ideal. Recaptures. Black is equal at this point in the endgame. It is ideal. Very precise. It is best. A passed pawn is pushed by this. It is quite good. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. This exchange is fair. It is ideal. Backs off. It is ideal. 
the best choice is this one. It is ideal. Perfectly on point. It is ideal. The knight is now on a square that is more secure. It is ideal. The moved pawn advances toward its objective. A passing pawn could be promoted as a result of this. It is ideal. As a result, the adversary may promote a passed pawn. It is incorrect. There was only one move that was effective, and this wasn't it. A chance to advance a passed pawn towards promotion is lost in this. That falls flat. By moving it from the back rank, this activates the king in the end game. It is ideal. The moved pawn advances toward its objective. This raises a pawn to the rank of queen. It is ideal. Material is lost as a result of this. There was just one smart move to be made. It is a mistake. This same piece may have been captured in a better method, which would have produced a more noticeable material difference. It falls flat. A passing pawn could be promoted as a result of this. It is incorrect. This defends a pawn that was under attack and had no defenders. This prevents the opponent from being able to push a passed pawn towards promotion. It is excellent. This moves away from the queen of checking. It is ideal. That is a logical response. It is quite good. This avoids the queen's check. It is ideal. A pawn that was being attacked and had no defenses is now protected by this. It is quite good. This moves away from the queen of checking. It is ideal. A knight is lost as a result of this. The adversary is then able to fork parts. It is a mistake. This forks multiple pieces. This is the only move that works. It is a great move. This prevents a queen on the other side from checking. It is ideal. This introduces another attacker, further endangering the knight who is already pinned. It is ideal. Very precise. It is best. That knight will get material if captured. It is ideal. This gives the adversary the opportunity to promote a passed pawn. It is incorrect. A passed pawn is pushed by this. It is ideal. A wise decision. It is quite good. A powerful play. It is quite good. What I would have advised is that. It is ideal. It was a free pawn there. It is quite good. This avoids the queen's check. It is quite good. Among the best actions. It is quite good. This blocks the check from an opposing queen. It is excellent. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. Black got the better of white in that game. Both players had an amazing opening. That was an incredible middle game by both players. Black had the better end of a sloppy end game. This is the strongest option. It is best. Giveaway one player was winning, but then gave it away. Black got the better of white in that game. Both players had an amazing opening. That was an incredible middle game by both players. Black had the better end of a sloppy end game.